Good evening, Samurai! Welcome to the stream, welcome to the channel, welcome to the Vortex. My name is Ezio and I will be your guide this evening as we once more journey into worlds, into realms and new. Do not adjust your sets. Yes, it is a Monday evening. Yes, I am indeed live because I won't be live tomorrow, so therefore we're trying to cram as many streams in as possible. It is the last bank holiday until December. It is also the end of my week off, my last week off for the year pretty much I think at least until Christmas so yeah back to free streams a week until after September or late September either which way things things time constraints blah 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 also hail stray girl hail real spawn into each and every one of you viewer chatter be will lurk a welcome for those of you who couldn't join us on the previous leg of our journey we ventured forth across Gerudo we went looking for seeds I got very drunk and not much else happened to be honest. Hey all Ninten, welcome. So, with that said, come join me as we once more step foot into the Vortex as we continue to travel and traverse the world, the realm of the Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. Our destination lays before us, the controls are set and as always the switch still needs to be turned on, so let's go. Shall we? Oop. Also, it's really warm this evening. I assume it's just humid. And now we kill the capture car. Or at least the signal to the capture car. Oh yeah, now I remember. We kind of got ourselves back on track with where we were doing and what we were doing and how we were doing. And we've got 519 car up seats. Awesome. There we go. And 98 shrines of 130, 40 or something. Right, you two. Where are we going first? Straight down to help Hudson. Hey, Hudson. <laughs> Not even Hudson, it's Anderson. Um, bro, you you do realise that if you had put your sign about here, it probably would have balanced long enough for you to tether it down, right? No? Okay. Fine. Let's see what we can do with this one. Um, well, there's not a lot I can do with Addison, but we can at least try and help him. A couple of boxes. This doesn't work. My name is Jim Bob. Right. Hey, old Jambri. Welcome. Waifu of the moment. Ooh, good question. Hmm. Hmm. A2, near automata. If only because I just saw a really nice fan art of her. <laughs> I'm not even bothering to read all of this out now because it's just the same words over and over and over again. Yes, I saw it. There we go. Scorching meaty rice, my balls, marvelous. Push room, awesome. I appreciate the gift from your girlfriend, Addison. Right. Um. Yes, I am still sticking by that head cannon. Right now, what are we doing? Oh yeah, we're going to mark this off on the dungeon map because I really need to remember to do that. Hey. Uh... Uh-oh. Uh, right, no, never mind. There is the tower. Yes. I really should stop marking the towers off as complete. Surprised they didn't Harley Qu say Harley Quinn because of Arlene Sorkin's demise. Harley Quinn's a bit of a tricky one. Also, crazy... And I'm not sure about crazy. <laughs> oh, excuse me. Right. Um. You know, I'm going to reinstate the tower on my dungeon map just so I actually have an idea of where, where I've at least got a point of reference. So next is the cherry blossom and these. 
Uh, I think we can do those. Or we go and do the stuff over there. Hmm. I might do that, actually, and work my way back around to the tower. Oh, oh, come on. Right. Oh, first things first. I will get to that redeem in a minute. Um, she did the voice for uh, Harley Quinn and Arkham Asylum says that. Yes, but I don't like the design of Harley Quinn and Arkham Asylum. I was going to take a throat lozenge before I do that redeem, but I've just realised that bo they both expired. One in January of this year and the other one in April of this year. I don't think they're going to work. Right, okay then. New plan. Uh, give me a minute. And back. Right. Uh, let's, these should still be good. Right. <clears throat> Hail Hoodlum. Actually, now give me a minute. Do do do. Here we go, five minutes of Majima, and also, hello, Hoodlum Chan, welcome. Also, my voice is broken, so let's see how long I can do the Majima voice for, shall we? So, where are we going? Putting off the Redeem more than he puts off the story. <laughs> where did I put my baseball bat? Either way. No, it's because I've got a sore throat, so I decided to take a throat lozenge before we did the Majima voice. Unfortunately, those two are expired, so I'm not going to stick them down my gob. So instead, we're using Fisherman's Friends. Which are rather nice. As far as I'm concerned, at any rate... Karak Seed or Mini Boss? Let's go poke the Mini Boss. Ooh, I've also realised I'm using the wrong bow. We can't possibly have that. That's a very bad idea. Do you know what's good for a sore throat? Dark? Oh, well. Uh... <laughs> Where's my flask? Oh, it's in my pocket. Of course it is. Hail, Hudlin. Cheers. Fisherman's friends and whiskey. <laughs> Not a good combination. Woo. Yes, Hudlum showing off all the points this evening. Though the limit break has been turned off after I was rather unwell yesterday. And by that I mean my poor liver. <laughs> Perhaps... That is not the smartest of ideas. There is also a... Um... Hello? Rug? What are you doing here, then? What kid you, Chan? How hungover were you? Not very, just a bit queasy. Makes me laugh, though, considering that was my second weekend of being hungover due to too much whiskey. Uh, there's the... Hello, Mr. Talus. My name is Link. I'm here to take you to a nice garden store. Yes. That certainly hurt. <laughs> ascend, please ascend. Yes, there we go. <laughs> yeah. 
No, that was just rude. That is rather annoying. Hmm. Oh! Oh. I appear to be missing anything to fuse with this. Ah, no I'm not! The Master Sword is back! Oh, well then. I found a diamond. Marvelous. We need those. Rather important. I don't spend all of my points on Netflix, Starbucks, and Avocado Toast. Instead... I get a nice point investment from my parents and proceed to judge everyone else my age. <laughs> oh well, so much for the mash in my voice. Time is up. I'll have to remember to use the fisherman's friends when I do the mash in my voice. Um, right, there is a frog here who is requesting something. Question, what is the frog requesting? Answer, I have no idea. Would you accept this rock? No. Would you accept this golden apple? No. Would you accept this diamond? No. Um... A hydromelon? No. Mighty bananas. No. A normal apple. No. Um, are there any clues around here as to what Mr. Frog would like? Or do I just give in and ask the oracle? There's also a Glico over there. It's a flame Glico. Marvelous. Um. Would Mr. Frug like one of these dust balls? I've also just realized I should probably heal at some point. That might be an idea. Oh. Um. Also, I love how most of my weapons just clip through the ground now. Brooke says no. Hmm. Okay, I give up. Right, what does the frog want? Oh. Uh. Why I accidentally mark this as fun? Oh. Uh. 
Apparently, this isn't a Korok seed. It's just a, a random frog statue that's... Okay, sure. Fine. Okay, then. Let's go kill a Geeko. Glacko. Bing Bong. Diddly diddly. With whatever its name is. Oh, wait, actually. <clears throat> Before we go and try and kill the Glico, perhaps I should make sure that I actually have a, you know, flame resistance potion on me. On the on the happenstance that it'll cook me alive otherwise. Um, <clears throat> yep, nope, no, we have seven minutes of frame, flame fruit elixir. That should work. Should probably also equip a savage lionel bomb. Good savage line up. Um oh also yes, good shout from chat. Heal first, that would be an idea also. And I'll equip the master sword, though it's going to last all of point four of a picosecond, I think. Yeah, that's... <laughs> I should have thought about that one. Oh, right. Um, he's going to wake up in a minute and be very angry, isn't it? Oh, this is going to be a not one one to find. Oh, right, yeah, um, actually. Oh, is it because, no, no, I think I just got lucky on the last one. We went from basically being obliterated by these guys to just taking them out in one. Nice. M7, welcome. Ah, <laughs> oh, look at the clapping Wookie. Right, sorry. <clears throat> anyway, right, on with the next bit. You never took the Flame Guard elixir even. No, no, I seem to have survived without... I don't know how, probably because I was far enough away. There appears to be a glowy glowy down there. Oh wait, that's going to be a bloopy. There's a cave nearby, isn't there? The, the, the big Lizophos, or, or no, no, oh no. Oh, 
Oh, well, so much for the Master Sword. Uh, oh, good job, Twilin. Good job, Riju, as well. Ha, ha. We need those eyeballs. Very useful for Glecos. Geeko, Gleco, Glinglong, Gibbity Gibbity. Whatever the name is. Remove the Glico icon? Nope. I keep the Glico icons on the principle of they'll be useful later on down the line. Mainly when I need to farm Glico components. Because inevitably I'll have to farm some Glico components. Radiant shield. I can't carry any more shields. Oh no, whatever will I do? Um, well, boy. Uh, that's the weakest. Ooh, topaz. Ah, rare ailment. Ah, two rubies and a topaz. Oh yeah, right, I need to remember to get a photo of the bauble fruit as well, since I can't remember if I've actually got a photo of the bauble fruit. You, you'd think this late in the game I would have, but at the same time, it, it's also me. So, yes. Oh, I haven't got a photo of a bubble frog. Ah, cool. Thank you, YouTube comment section. There go, a couple of flint. And everything. It looks like everything. Cool. Right. Back to the grind. So I'll mark that Gleeco was done on the dungeon map, and I will mark the Spectacle Rock Cave as done as well, because it is. And now I'm freezing to death again. There we go, I've put on a warm shirt. Thank you, YouTube comment section. That's a sentence you never hear. Hey, the people in the YouTube archive are awesome. We're at about 330 subscribers. Well, 333 subscribers in the YouTube archive now, so yeah. Hundred hundred more, and I can start monetizing the content. Mwahaha. Uh, why have I got a Steam notification? Oh, cool! Right, a game on my wish list is on sale. Perhaps I shall buy it, or perhaps not. Who knows? Another question: Where's this blasted Karoxy? Um. And my answer to a previous question, how hungover was I yesterday? Not very. I've, I've had worse. Oh, 
colleagues leaving do suddenly comes to mind where there was a lot of whiskey consumed and then I had to drag myself into work the following day because I was the only tech on duty. That wasn't fun. I had to trundle myself off to McCall's on campus, get myself a LucasAid Sport and then just sit there miserable for about three hours <laughs> with no food. It was not fun. I just noticed Ezio look the... Wait, I just noticed Ezio looks like Link with shorter hair. I'll take that as a compliment. Um, I guess I'm missing a Torox seed. I assume it's going to be one of these blasted tree stump ones. Even though we're about to be led right back to the frog, which actually turns out to be a Korok seed, and I just didn't realise. Um... <laughs> oh wait, nice as Oppos tells. Oh no, no, I've already got them. Okay, that's fine. Um <laughs> I think that's a Gerudo flag. Ah, uh, I'm gonna have to look this up on the Oracle, aren't I? Sorry if I'm a bit sniffly as well. I think I'm coming down with a cold. Um... Mm. Apparently, it is a platform race. So where be the platform? Oh, found it. Opposite direction than I was expecting. Hmm. How's the orchestra rehearsing going? Very well. We are sounding brilliant. And I'm actually managing most of the notes now, rather than in contrast to my first couple of sessions with the MWO, where... Um, <laughs> I basically just mined the entire rehearsal with the occasional note because I couldn't actually... Uh, I didn't know the pieces. And my sight reading is really not that good. Getting better with practice, but still. No, I think the concert in September is going to be amazing. It'll be a long day for me, but it's going to be amazing. Hello, what? Oh no! Ah, look! Liz of us! Whatever will I do? That's what I'm gonna do. I'll go grab the soldier's broadsword while I'm at it. And I'll start breaking to crates because I need to restock my arrows. Of which there were none. Okay, fun. Marvelous, thank you. From what you said, you all sound amazing. Aye, and that was a couple of rehearsals ago. Oh, balls. Maybe I'll post the the last uh, Facebook Live that we did. To the Discord, by the way, in case anyone's curious. <laughs> Which was super supercalifragilisticexpialidocious. There we go. I'm 
one can't see. Only at 100 Karak Seed? No, we're at about 500 and something. But we gave... It, it's only counting the ones in my inventory. The ones that we've given to... We've already given about 400 to Hetsu, as denoted by the fact that we've unlocked all of our inventory slots. So... Um... I'm missing a Karak Seed, which I'm guessing is going to be one of those Ascendi... No, it isn't. Well, gee willikers, do you think it might be to do with this big pile of leaves? Boosh. No, so halfway through. Pretty much, yeah. Hello! I see, you enjoyed your rock so much, you placed another rock upon it. Your rock is no more. Ha ha! Anyway, um... Right, mark the Karok seed. Oop. Place the boulder on the thing. Done. Karok under the root, under the leaf pile. Done. I offer this apple to the great Satori. Wait, what am I doing? I've done the cherry blossom. I'll come back to that eventually if needs be. Uh, right. So we've done the Karok seeds in this area of the map and the mini bosses. So now we have a choice. Did I just say I will offer this apple to praise a Tory? No, Hodlum. No, I did not. And you know dang well that I did not. I offer this apple in praise of Sir Tory. Not Sir Tory. Not Sat Tory. Sir Tory. As in the mystical horse creature that that strange brother of the monster seller, I forget his name now, wishes to turn into. Um... Doesn't answer my question either. Where do we go? So we can go from there to there, or we go there, or we could go there, or we could just glide down. Um Wait, have I Mr. Corox? I'm I've Mr. Coroxid. Oh okay. Well we can always go back and do that one later. We will have to go back that way to get a pona anyway, but still. Um I am sorry, but I heard praise of Tory. Well, if that's who you vote for, Hoodlum, all the power to you, but it's not really my cup of tea. Uh, right. Let's see now. I missed him the first time around. Ah, well. <clears throat> oh, some arrows. Platform of sorts. Wall is off off. <laughs> really? Make it far too easy. Oh, Master Sword's back as well. Huh? 
Oh, we can't photograph them. Okay, shame. Mm. Right, so from the looks of it, there's just a bunch of caves in this part of the map. No, oh, it's a blue pea in a bush. I thought it was... Uh, hello. Oh, it was a fire. Okay. Good to know. Just randomly out in the open. Why? Missed it. Hello. Help! Listen to me, Lizard. Oh no, Lizardos! Whatever will I do? Oh wait a minute. Well, that was supremely difficult and challenged me to every essence of my capabilities. Oh no! That wasn't Bennett. This game really isn't designed for people like me, is it? Who just basically run through and do absolutely everything before the story. Right. <laughs> Whoa, you're strong! Yes, I am. <laughs> you might think I'm a hopeless coward, and you'd be right. But you wouldn't be entirely wrong either. Uh, uh, not wrong at all, if I'm honest. I, 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 ignore the puddle in the corner. Don't ask where it came from. But um, uh, I'm also a bodyguard myself, you know. Yes. I was traveling with my friends, but we got separated. And then I saw those monsters and I completely froze up. Uh, don't tell anyone. Okay. Ah. Well, I'd better get going. My friends will surely feel safer with the fearless bodyguard by their side. <laughs> Bye. Okay then, have fun with that. And that is the Starly Plateau Cave done, apparently. Um question is where is that on the map? Um Starly Plateau. Night shield, so don't need to worry about that. Cooking pot. I'll leave that be for the moment. Oh hello. Uh, disaster in Gerudo Canyon. Ooh. I've missed a sub-story. <laughs> Sorry, Mr. Bloopy. Or in fairness, I need rupees in this game. It didn't get me a lot of rupees, then. Yeah, I wish there was a quick action menu for reduce power. It's easy enough to use talons because I just get an A prompt when I once I'm gliding, but with Reju I have to run up and actually talk to her, which is a bit difficult in the middle of battle. Um just for a second, I did not vote Wait, Just for the record, I did not vote Tory. I voted for Waitrose. Uh, wait, what? <laughs> I did not vote Tory, and neither does Ezio, even though he shops at Waitrose. I don't shop at Waitrose! Hey, Epona. How's life? You good? Good. 